Hey, y'all. Welcome. Welcome back to Artistic License, my Sunday stream. We're doing another part. We're still playing Hat to Full Boyfriend, but now we are going to be doing Sakuya's Root. So the way that Sakuya's Root works is very similar to um, Shu's. He's got a full ending and then like a normal ending. Um, his class is music, which will be interesting. We haven't done a lot of music. So if we do the music, we get his full ending. If we do some other class, we'll probably do math since we've done that one a few times. We know what happens in it. Then we get his like normal ending. Okay. So here we go. Let's start a new game just like we have been. And we're doing Sakuya this time. Okay, so my main... Ooh, did not mean to hit the mic. Sorry about that. Aaron Terry. Hey, Ninja, how's it going? You're just in time to see Sakuya's route. We're going to find out what's going on with him. Yes, Karen Terry is okay. How are you doing today, Ninja? I hope you're doing well. Yes, I do want human portraits. I always want the human portraits. Okay, we're going to talk to this Ninja a little bit. Um, wait. Huh? The normal life promise. What is this? Hey, let me look. Hmm. I think we're gonna do a normal life. I think this must be, this must be a different achievement. Okay, we're gonna do a normal life. Oh, thank you so much, Ninja. Thank you. Um. Okay. The normal life. We'll do the full promise later. Okay. Me. Back. Okay. Stop. Yeah, there we go. Fast forward just a little bit. Fast as part. Yes. 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 Okay. <coughs> oh, the teacher's here. Good morning, everybody. I'm Nanaki Kazu Kazuakai. I'm here to be your teacher this year. I specialize in math and physics, and also some other things. Hmm. <laughs> He's sleeping. Sir, wake up, it's homeroom. He sleeps with his eyes open? Yes, he does. But I know that Saki is in here a little bit. Wouldn't you just love the choice, right? Like, I wish I woke up every morning and got to choose normal day or crazy day. Um, that it was actually, like, a choice that I made. Okay, come on. Get to the, get to the Saki lines. That's what we care about. Here we go. What is the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think I'm here because I wish to be. Oh, well, I guess that's that. Hey, that's no good. But he doesn't want to introduce himself. But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all turn into kulaks and dissenters. <laughs> well, when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shirogane? Shirogane Labelle Sakia. And there he is, our, our route that we're doing this time. It seems this fantail is Shirogane Sakuya. His feathers would make any birdie proud. He's pretty stuck up, but then transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. Sakia sits down, glaring daggers at Ryota and me. I think this little bird is telling me that there's going to be trouble down the line. Oh, there's going to be trouble. There's going to be trouble. This is elaborate scene for me to see. Let's get this. Yeah, I was your brother just like in the morning and be like, oh, no, no, stop, stop, I said it. And we just said, oh, she's huge, but I wanted to see that, I think we already, yeah, we already said it. Oh, well, we did just watch it, um, a second ago, so it's okay. Yeah, see, yeah, we just did your read, very interesting. Okay, and, oh, this is huge, we don't need to see her. Yeah, it's not pretty long, eh, craziness. Maybe I'll take a look, yep. Yeah. yeah, so we're gonna pick up. Oh, this is track. No, we don't need this scene either. Because I'm just gonna keep reading about it, this one exists. We should probably try to do his read at some point today. Okay. For him, what club are we supposed to do? Student council. Oh, oh that makes sense, because he is in the student council. A foolish question. I already hold a position here. Oh, that's right. You became student president when you were admitted. Nepotism ho! Don't we get to vote? Just coming to school is enough for me. You have to take care of your mother on your own and all. Mmm, I wonder what I should do. Join the... We're gonna join the student council. That's everyone, isn't it? Have fun. Today is an elective day. What should I do? Okay, we're going to do music every time this time. Music. Come on. Never wants to click the bottom option. We sang birdie melodies. It was a little tiring, but singing together is fun. Karen leveled up. Okay, charisma. Oh, I guess, yeah, if you take music, your charisma goes up. We did know that. Thank you, Kendra. How are you doing today? I hope Lucas and Eliza are having a lovely Sunday as well. I was pretty sure I wanted to join it, but what does the council do again? 
We skipped the vote, and I think it's only Sakuya and me. Anyway, he called a meeting, so to the council room I go. I hope you're having an absolutely lovely Sunday. What are you doing today besides um, hanging out with, uh, with me for a little bit? This looks like a CEO's office. Naturally. Do you think I would stand for anything less? Hi, Sakuya. So you had this done. Hmm. This room used to be filthy. Better suited for rabbits than us. What a prig. Have you decided which position you'll take? I get to choose. Who is there to choose for you? Dumb Japanese. Aren't you Japanese too, Sakuya? Do not mock me. I am French. A French noble bird. That sounds delicious. I guess I'll have to pick a post now. I think I'll be the... Oh, packing for a conference? Lucas on a plane? Right? I think he's right up your alley, Kendra. He is great. Okay, so I'm going to be the vice president. You wish to be my right wing? <laughs> ha! You've got some nerve. I like that. I think I just got bonded with. Gosh, he looks pretty happy right now. And so I became vice president of the school council. <laughs> uh, Kendra, at some point when you have extra time, you need to go to my YouTube channel and go back and watch the shoe route. It's on my YouTube. You will love it. <laughs> That's kind of the Japanese stereotype, right, Ninja? So I don't know. Uh, poor Sakuya. Maybe he doesn't know. <laughs> Wouldn't make, really make sense, though, since he's living in Japan. He should probably know what the stereotype is. Anyway. Uh, sitting at home is so relaxing. Oh, tomorrow's the class hike. Should I prepare anything? We won't be going far, so I don't have to. Well, health first. I think I'll have some udon and go to sleep. Today's the hike. We stopped to break on a hillside. Who should I talk to? Talk to... Oh, right. Saku is actually an option. I don't have to do Kazuki. Okay, so we get a new scene for real. Unacceptable! In a temper as usual. Why? Why do I have to come to a place like this and on foot? It's a hike, Sakuya. You have to walk. For what purpose? As exercise? Foolish exercises for presents. No, for fun. You're supposed to enjoy the change of scenery. Look over here. Don't we have a nice view? Hmm. Sakuya looks like he still has something to say, but he reluctantly comes over to me. I think maybe he's acting angrier than he really is. What a kid. Okay. <laughs> okay, elective day again. We're going to do music. Music for Sakuya. I have been. Yeah, oh, good, good, good. I, I'm really enjoying this game. Today is a music history lesson. So much thinking outside the box. I feel like I'm going to fly off the handle. But this is what Mozart is all about, I guess. I wonder what those wigs felt like. They look like they were wearing ptarmigans? I think I struggled with this word when I got this scene before. Ptarmigans on their heads. I don't know what that is. Do you seek to mock the great master's low-born philistine? No. I was just making puns. You don't think I'm very punny? Yeah, thinking we're thinking outside the box. Exactly. <laughs> Uh, I imagine you're all aware, but the sports festival is right around the corner. Please think about what you'll do. Sports festival season already? Okay, we have seen this. We'll just click past it. Um, I know that I'm going to have to choose something. You can't possibly be expecting me to run in some race, can you? It's a sports festival. There's an event that doesn't involve running. How about being a cheerleader? Yeah, yeah, and then he's going to be a cheerleader. Um, I don't think that... Also, the first aid team is always shorthanded, so I'm sure they could use help if any birdie still can't decide. That's all for today. Ryota's doing the three-legged race. Okasan's running a marathon, and Sakuya's a cheerleader. Yuya might be running the first aid tent. What should I do? I'll have to think about it. Okay. Let's see. Uh, what should I do? This doesn't have a guy. It doesn't say what I'm supposed to do. But obviously I'm supposed to do the cheerleaders, right? Okay, we're just going to choose cheerleaders. 
There's something of a crowd around our cheerleaders. I see Sakuya and a brass band? That's overdoing it. I think I saw something similar during the changing of the guard at Buckingham Palace. You're here. You're not cutting any corners, I see. Naturally not. Only the best from La Belle. Sir, preparations are complete. Sir, your orders, sir. Very well, begin. And so the band began to play. Where did he get all these people? They all look like professionals. Shouldn't cheerleaders be students? You join in. Um, okay. I seem to be in charge of the symbols. One wrong slip and I'll be the laughing stock of the playground. Yikes. Saki is conducting is awfully flashy. Is this the LaBelle style? Okay, okay. The first barrier for all students who may get this far, the midterm exam. We'll be getting them back today. Uh, I don't think I did too well. Terry, yes. Um, I don't think you did too badly. Yes? Not too, mm, nope, sorry, you did, yeah, okay. So if you take music, you do badly. I guess really the only way to do good on your midterms and final is to take all the math. With the festival and midterm over, there's nothing to do but look forward to the summer heat. Doves smell kind of funny when it gets too humid like this. Mm, there's a bunch of birds in front of the staff room. What are they doing? Oh, there's Yuya. Yuya, what's going on? Salutations, Karen. Brian won his seventh Pulitzer. He gestures at the news clipping on the staff room pinboard. It says, Brian, the first intelligent pigeon crowned again. Brian? Don't tell me you don't know who he is. I think I've heard the name, but... He's the world's most famous blogger. He began when birds were barely intelligent. He's a very skilled and insightful writer. He was the one who suggested that the Dove Olympics be called the Pidge Olympics. He's extremely influential. The name was adopted right away. Why don't you look him up right now, mon ami? Try googling Brian Pigeon. Okay. Okay. Uh-oh. Lunch is nearly over. Adieu, Karen. Well, that's cool. You get a Yuya scene during um, Sakuya's route. I'd better hurry back to class. Hello, every- Huh? There's a pile of overturned desks in the middle of the floor. Ryota is overturned next to them. Rock Dove's underwings and bellies are light, so they look pretty different upside down. I mean, wait, what's going on? Ogasan and Sakuya. I look up to see the two of them at each other's throats in the corner. I think we might have a diplomatic incident on our hands. What happened, Ryota? Sakuya was making fun of Ogasan. Called him a stupid mongrel who thinks about imaginary pudding and said he was ashamed to be in the same class. That's terrible. I mean, Okasan is a nutcase, and I don't know what he's saying half the time, but he really does like pudding. Either way, Okasan kind of went for the jugular, and you tried to pull them apart, and Okasan used wing attack on you. Y yep, yep. You're our only hope now, Karen. <laughs> Cuckoo! <laughs> Okasan will not allow pudding or himself to be ridiculed. You will apologize. You tell me to take back my word. I shall not. A mongrel like you hasn't even the right to speak to me. Coo! Okasan is not a mongrel. The battle still rages, and it looks like Ryota's sacrifice was in vain. I should. Okay, what am I supposed to do? Uh. The guide doesn't have. What the heck? This guide is being ridiculous, but I guess since I'm doing Sakuya's route, I sh it should be obvious. I side with. I side with. Sakuya. Okasan, settle down. This is a classroom. Coo! This is a matter between doves. Stay out of it, Karen. You are a credit to your simian ancestry, Terry. I respect your judgment. Coo! I catch Okasan and throw him out the window. Threw him out the window? Just because you're angry doesn't mean you can make a mess. Come back in when you're prepared to be civilized. What the heck? What's up with- Oh my gosh. Saki is getting to me. He is getting to me. Mm, today is a good day. I feel like I'm shining. Okay, now the guide finally picks back up. It just totally skips May for some reason. I don't know. I wonder what I should do during break. Go to the... We're going to go to the store. I don't need anything. I think I'll go to the store. I never really grew up before. Well, I've got all sorts of materials. Look at what you're trying to get in. Oh, is this the same you've seen? Am I much sure if you want to be in? Yeah, this is. Yeah, this is the same you've seen. Let's look at it. See if you can change this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to do this. Um, I think it's a little rude. Apparently, this is what we're supposed to choose. Okay. Yeah, I think it's a little rude. Yeah, yeah, that didn't change. That was the same. 
Today's an elective day. We're gonna attend music. Let's go to a music class. Come on, there we go. We all have to stand up and sing solos today. Ah, oh, I'm nervous. Cuckoo, cuckoo, cuckoo. His voice is beautiful. Very cute. More charisma. Hanabata! There's probably a bamboo tree in the plaza. I think I'll go make a wish. But we can do a different wish this time. There's lots here already. Any birdie I know? Oh, he's sad he's not really French. I think. Can you hear the song from above? May they send you happiness, mon ami. What should I wish for? Okay, we're going to wish to become a famous artist. I wish to become a famous artist whose work is known in the world over. Oh, hello, hello is that you, Terry? It's Nucky. Okay, okay, this is the same as before. Um, and we do not have office. No. Yeah, I saw some The only person sad they aren't French other than third grade me. <laughs> well, he's a French, I think he's, he's a French breed of pigeon. I don't really know too much about pigeons, but that's what I'm assuming is going on here. But he's not French, he's Japanese. <clears throat> Today's an elective day. Okay, we're going to attend music. I've been placed in charge of the timpani today. Last time it was the, what am I supposed to be, a musical gorilla? Oh, I guess I liked it. I was good with the timpani. Ooh, this is new. We're having swimming class with the third years today. All the damp, tight clinging feathers are making my heart race. Oh boy. <laughs> Salutations, Sakia. The wetsuit suits you well. That was not his voice. I did the wrong voice. Do you mock me? Hardly. I'm praising you. I'm proud to have such a handsome little brother. Your very act of speaking to me is an insult, mongrel. You probably can't even sue him. Oh, I wonder. Want to decide who's faster once and for all, little brother? Fool, we already know who the victor will be. But to ignore a challenge would be a disgrace to my name. Very well. Mon ami. Yes? Will you be our judge? I shall judge your noble combat with all possible fairness. Of course. And just out of curiosity, who do you think will win? Probably Sakuya. <laughs> probably Sakuya, obviously. Well, Saki is an aristocrat, so probably him. <laughs> Even the hominid recognizes my superiority. <laughs> That's harsh. Get set, go! They die with perfect synchronization. Yikes, they're both fast. Even though their skeletal structure isn't designed for it at all. It was awfully close, but in the end... So who won, mon ami? It was almost too close to tell, but Yuya was a little faster. <gasps> well, there you have it, little brother. I can hear Sakuya grinding his beak in frustration. This is some sort of mistake. This is some sort of mistake. I demand a rematch. Sure, I'm always happy to take you on. Yuya looks pleased. Maybe he's happy because he got to talk to Sakuya. That's giving him a lot of credit. That's giving him a lot of credit. <laughs> we get our finals back. Okay, I think for music, uh, yeah, I, you do badly. You, it's really, truly only math that makes you do well. Today is the last day. It's been a semester already. Sometimes it seemed long and sometimes it seemed short, but either way, it's summer now. I think Saku is said to help him clean the council room before going home. He always gets angry if I make him wait, so I should hurry. You're late. I came as fast as I could. Sorry, Sakuya. Let's start cleaning. Very well. First, move the shelf and... Oh, this is his voice. First, move the shelf and chairs. There's dust underneath. Okay. Next, inside the cupboard, arrange the files by date. Okay. And then the floor. Polish it at least three times. And the window... Hold on. Are you telling me to do all of this by myself? Who else is there? You bonehead. Maybe I should stand up to him. Um, this is 720. You help, yeah, you help too. Sakia, I'm the vice president, not the charwoman. Oh, excuse me. Is that so? My job is to help you, so maybe you should be taking the lead role in cleaning up. That's why I'm giving you orders. 
No, geez, that's not what I... Here's a mop. Work. Uh, you... What? You know how to use it, right? Let's get started. Ugh. Don't tell me you've never... Of course not. Talk about living in the lap of luxury. So, Saki reluctantly helped me clean. I thought he might complain for a while, but he certainly can be obedient. Now then, the sooner we finish, the sooner we get to go home. Well, that was new information, so he can be obedient when, uh, when told. It's easy to fall out of practicing and fat and lazy during summer vacation. A hunter-gatherer's body is her way of life, so maybe I'll go running today. And, oh, this is the ladybird again, so we'll fast forward her part. Okay, speed past. I think we can speed past until we get to the job. We're going to forget it this time. Not going to do the job. <clears throat> Still a long time until the semester starts and I have a lot of homework. Maybe I should apply for a part-time job. No. No. No job. No job. Why do you need a job? You're a hunter-gatherer. Mm, I think I'll wait until college. That way I can skip lectures to go to work. Slacking off and having fun is more of a high schooler thing to do. Whee! Today is the local summer festival. I think I'll go with somebody. Invite. Sakuya, Sakuya. Yes. Sakuya. Sakuya, over here. You've got the nerve to call me out during vacation. What is it? Oh, you're right. You just moved here, so you wouldn't have known. Today's the festival. Let's go together. Festival? What's that? You'll understand when you see it. Come on. What the? Shops, food, good fun all around. People can't possibly be eating food prepared like this. It's unsanitary. It's madness. Don't worry. There haven't been any reports of food poisoning for two years. So there were reports three years ago. Yep. <laughs> Guiding the panic-stricken Saku around the festival is a little troublesome, but hilarious nonetheless. And so the night wears on. Huh, when did you buy that candy apple, Sakuya? They had an interesting color, so I thought I would buy one. I'm not going to eat it. I shall take it home and mount it in a case. What? Sakuya, it's going to rot. The heck. You're going to eat it, obviously. I knew I should have gotten up when I first woke up. I slept way too late. School starts today, right? I'm going to be late. Let's see, is there anything? There's nothing here. We're going to return to our glorious abode. <clears throat> Come on. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Yep. Um, good mor- Oh. Good morning, everyone. I hope you had fun over the summer. Woo! Okasan's always having fun. Yup, yup. What is this fun? Once summer is over, time starts slipping by faster than ever. Try to stay focused. Focus, sir, focus. <sighs> Second term. Huh? Is that a student ID? Oh yeah, this is a student ID scene. Is there anything? Is there anything here? No. We've seen this. Today's an elective day. We're going to attend music. Oh, I forgot my recorder. I don't think we have any spares. I, I do have my hich Hichiriki, at least. You can play that? Yes, I can. I don't know what a Hichiriki is. I think I said that last time I saw this scene. This late already? Let's stop here for today. We'll start looking at some new formulas next time, so try to read ahead, okay? Hmm. The lassitude of Japan's educational system never ceases to amaze me. You don't like it, Mr. Nanaki's class, Sakia? That was that read that line totally wrong, whatever. What do you think? And I'm not just talking about the math. Not only is attendance at the school mandatory, but everything it covers is so infantile. It bores me to yawning. Hey, at least Mr. Nanaki won't chew you out for snoozing in class, right? I don't think that's the issue here, Ryota. 
Look out, look at Ogasan. He's conked out as soon as we took attendance. <laughs> exactly. These pathetic teaching practices that destroy the students' motivation and interest. No wonder nobody takes the school seriously. But isn't Mr. Nanaki a big name in science? I mean, I'm not really that well informed, but I don't think it's very nice to go around piddling on him, Sakia. We don't really know his capabilities as a teacher quite well, Terry. Do you mean to say that we should respect and obey him simply because he's a teacher? His fame is merely at the national level anyway. The only world-renowned professor here would be Dr. Iwamune. Eh? The doctor's that well known? I never heard about that. Oh my god, y'all, is Sakura in league with Iwamune? Oh. <laughs> it is Okasan's Os pudding. I'm surrounded by ignoramuses and fools. He is in a world authority on pathology. His name is known the world over. Anyway, Nanaki does not even come close. I never knew the doctor was that famous, but then why is he working as a doctor for a high school, even if it's a prestigious one? Yeah, that is weird, isn't it? Today's the school festival. Our class has decided on a maid cafe. I'm not scheduled to work until tomorrow, so I have the day off. I don't have anything to do, so I guess I'll go look around. Isn't 2-4 doing a haunted house? I'm well known for my reckless nature, so maybe I'll go ahead and scream a little bit. I think Saku is free today, too, isn't he? Maybe I should invite him along. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Invite him. Invite him to the haunted house. I gotta switch earphones, though. My ears hurt. There we go. Oh, it was stuck behind the headband. That's why it hurt. The heck? Sakuya! Do you need something? You're free today, right? Wanna go to Two Four's haunted house? Haunted house? A waste of time. Nothing but a foolish charade of commoners. By commoners. And for commoners. How do you know if you don't go? And besides, isn't keeping an eye on the masses part of your noble bird's job? I suppose it might have some value. Since I have no other pressing matters to which I must attend, I shall accompany you. What is this madness? A haunted mansion? What on earth is that? Will we be attacked by hostile ninjas? No, that would be a ninja mansion. But my nurse told me that any mansion is bound to have ninjas lying in wait outside. What? Sakuya, what? It's like a tiny theme park with a ghost theme, hence haunted. How foolish. No doubt it has nothing but tricks to scare me or children. We shall enter. Oh, hey, wait. Okay, I guess he just ran in. <gasps> what trickery is this? I can't see. Why is it dark in here? Oh, right. You can't see in the dark, can you? Oh, I stepped on something nasty. N no, stop. Unhand me. Ah! Sakuya, calm down. No, you're not supposed to kick the poor ghosts. Let me go. <laughs> I've never seen him this worked up before. Anyway, I'm glad he enjoyed it, I think. Okay, well. <laughs> oh, Lord. Music class was fun today. Solo tests always make me nervous, but they can be fun too. I sang well today. We have physics next, right? Huh? Sakuya is standing in the music room, staring at the instrument rack. What's wrong, Sakuya? What? Do you think of the arts, Miss Terry? The arts? Where did that come from? Surely one such as yourself has an opinion of some kind. What do you think of the arts? Um, well, I'm not really sure it's something I could put into words. Just like that... Dostoevsky once said that an artist is a man who turns his ear inwards and writes with zeal what he hears. Such a common idea. He looks angst-ridden. I wonder if something happened. Hmm. What's wrong with looking inward, Sakuya? Finally done with cleaning. Time to go home. Hmm? I can hear somebody playing the piano in the music room at the end of the hall. Who? I think I'll... I'll go look. I can see somebody sitting at the piano through the door. I recognize him. It's... Sakuya? <gasps> How long have you been there? Were you spying on me? How unpleasant. No, I just came over here. It sounded beautiful. I never knew you could play. I'm amazed you can practice and still study enough to get such good grades, Sakuya. Of course. A noble must be versed in all fields, though I doubt one such as you can understand the art. It sounded wonderful. Hmm. 
Oh, I'm distracting you. Sorry. I'll go now, so don't mind me. Harry. What do you love? Why this all of a sudden? Tell me. Um, udon, I guess. Udon? Truly? Yeah, I eat it every day. I see, I see. Thank you. Okay. Bye, Sakia. And so I left him sitting deep in thought. What's that about? What was that about? Udon's an okay to love. We get our finals back. Okay, this is finals. I did bad. Yep. Keep it up. Thanks. I'll try. Okay, winter break's almost over. I got a letter in a fancy envelope. Who is it from? We're holding a Christmas party at Little Bell Mansion on the 24th of this month. You're invited. Be honored. <laughs> Signed, Sakuya. Wow. Ah, oh, I got a heartwarming invitation. It's kind of a passive-aggressive invitation, actually. My family's Buddhist, so I hadn't had anything planned. I might as well go, right? I think I'll... Um... This is another one with no direction. No, okay, it does have direction in the guide. Go to the party. Obviously, go to the party. Whoa, it's like a palace! <laughs> what do you think, Terry? Normally a commoner such as yourself would never set foot in here. It's amazing, Sakuya. This whole thing is far removed from my own uncultured Stone Age lifestyle. I feel a little nervous. Do you have a party like this every year? Every year? Don't be foolish. We have one every month. Creating a habitat for social discourse is a noble's duty, after all. That seems a little tiresome. Are you feeling overwhelmed already? Poor foolish comet. Coo! That's... Coo! This establishment lacks pudding. Oh my god, San is here. Koko, you dog. Why are you here? I never invited you. Koo! Okasan sensed a feast and came through the window, but there is no pudding. I wouldn't give any to you, even if I did have some. Confound you, you genetic throwback! Okasan's going berserk at this rate. I think I should... I should probably stop him. Yes. Let's, uh, let's stop Okasan. Okasan, inside voice! Well done, Terry. Now throw him outside. Yes, like I did before. <sighs> Fuck. I'm so violent with poor Okasan. I'm grateful to you, Terry. Now can we have our party in peace? No need to thank me. I would hire you as a bodyguard if I ever so desired. Um, okay. Sure. <laughs> Happy New Year. But it's raining. Oh, well. Oh, uh, I guess it's not rained normally. I'll go to the shrine, but this weather makes the wilderness dangerous. I think I'll sleep in like a good girl instead. I won't be able to send out cards in this rain either. Fiddlesticks. Huh. That's interesting. I think I must have done something wrong. Because, according to the guide, I was supposed to go and choose fulfillment in art, so something weird happened. Happy New Year, everyone. I hope you all had good vacations. I hibernated. What a shocker. You're still hibernating, sir. Wake up. Oh, uh, I said this before, but your junior year will be over before you know it. Let's enjoy this time while it lasts. There's nothing special this semester. Nothing to worry about. Okay, third term. Huh. Yeah, I mess, I messed something up. It's still light out, so maybe I'll get some... Okay, and Lego Lemons. Yes, we're going to go buy some beans. Buy beans, buy beans. Okay, for him, we're going to buy Racing Blend. I'll take these. Thank you, miss. Here you are. Today's the day. The preparations are complete. Time to give the beans to that special sunbirdie. Sakuya! I'm busy. May I ask you not to waste too much of my time? This will only take a minute. I have something for you. Here. What are these? It's a pricey blend of meat. Beans. I know you like expensive things. That's not what I meant. Why are you giving me beans? It's Legulamentines. And what's that? What planet are you from anyway? It's a holiday where girls are supposed to give beans to the boys they like. What? Don't look so disturbed. Jeez, I gave you those. Will you accept them, Sakuya? Huh. These beans seem... S oh. These beans seem somewhat cheap for their illustrious receipt, but... Since you asked it, I will not refuse them. 
Really? Yay! What do you mean by like? Huh? I'm asking what you meant by the boys they like. Um, exactly what I said. No matter what I'm doing or where I am, your beautiful plumage always comes to mind, Sakia. Hmm. Anyway, here. I hope we can continue to get along. Indeed. He glances at the beans and then at me, and then wordlessly leaves. I'm glad he liked them. He did like them, right? It's cold. It feels even colder than it was around New Year's. Maybe the wind's stronger? I'm starting to think I should build a wall or maybe dig myself a new bedroom. With this kind of weather, some birds are even collapsing in the street. Hey, wait. Isn't that one Sakuya? S Sakuya, what's wrong? D don't ask for details. Just carry me to your miserable abode. I beg of you. Wandering around and collapsing in the street at this time of night doesn't seem like a customary practice for an aristocrat. What happened, Sakuya? Don't tell me your family's fallen from high society. What happened? I shall not say. Huh? What were you doing wandering around in the wilderness, then? I was not wandering. I was on my way here. Be honored. Oh, so this isn't a coincidence after all. Did you want something from me, then? No, don't flatter yourself. Huh? Um, should we call your family or something? No. Looks really angry. Listen, don't... You dare. Don't you dare call my house. Sakia, did you run away from home? That sounds bad. No, I simply left of my own volition. Um, isn't that the same thing? Yep. What happened, Sakuya? Harry, do you remember when we talked about the music room at school last fall? Yes, what about it? Do you remember what I asked you then? You asked me what? You asked me what I loved. You asked me what I loved. That's right. And you gave a simple, honest answer right away. And that... That... That made me jealous. Did I miss here? That's the last thing I'd have expected from him, of all people. I don't understand, Sakuya. Why? I... I'm one of the few. Of the pure bloodline. I'm ranked higher than any of my siblings. I have been slated to become the next family head since birth. There's no reason I shouldn't be. But... I don't want to take... Oh. You don't want to take your father's place. H how did you know that? It's obvious. It's written all over your face. I, I love music, but my father does not approve. When I was young, I owned a number of instruments, but he had them all thrown away. Art is not our realm. The joy of creation is the domain of peasants. Our role is to be patrons and promoters of artists we admire, not to be the artists ourselves. A noble who shows his own wheat is a fool. That's not true. I think anyone who can play music should be encouraged, no matter who their parents are. That's because you think with a peasant's values. My world is different from yours. I'm, I'm not talking about what peasants think, I'm talking about what I think. What about you, Sakuya? What do you think? I think? Beacon Riddles. I carry the name LaBelle. To play at applying my own standards and ideas to the world would be a disgrace. But didn't you just say you left the mansion of your own accord? Isn't that applying your own idea to the world? Hmm... You contradicted yourself. What do you want to do in life, Sakuya? I must succeed. My father as the next family head. No, geez, that's not what I meant. What if you could forget about the LaBelle family and do anything in the world? What would you do then? Forget about the LaBelle family. What mockery is this? We're speaking hypothetically, dummy. If I could do anything in the world... I would continue studying music. I would like to see how far I could go as a musician. He sounds uncharacteristically modest. I was half expecting him to give some sort of rambling speech about he would unite the world and become king or something. You love music, don't you? If I could hear you play the piano again, I would be very happy, Sakuya. I think you've answered your own question. Answered my own question? Don't be ridiculous. This is a mere fantasy and I have no connection to reality. Have you told your father that you want to continue studying music? Don't be ridiculous! How could I lower myself so? So you haven't even asked him about it. You wouldn't be lowering yourself, Sakuya. 
Are you ashamed to love music? Hmm. You should ask him. It's worth a try, right? Hmm. Perhaps you are right. I suppose I never would have thought of that if I hadn't talked to you. You were confused about what you wanted, Sakia. I just gave you a little push. Terry. Yes? I'm going to speak with him when I return. If he refuses, I would. Would you carry my fallen body to safety one more time? Are you planning to want to run away for real next time? If it comes to that. I will follow you anywhere you need to go, Sakuya. You will always have a safe place here, okay? I shall return to you. Thank you, Terry. Wow. And so he set out across the wilderness once more. I don't know if his father will accept him or if he really will run away, but I know he will come back to me, and I pray that our future will be a happy one. Wow. Wake up! It's morning, Sakia. Silence! The halls of your father's has many lumps and sharp rocks, Terry. Jeez, what are you complaining about? I even got you some straw. Which is to say I did the best I could for a freeloader. Here, I made breakfast. Your first concert is today, so you need to get ready. Oh, he became a musician. Hmm. He didn't complain about the food. That's an improvement. Um, by the way. What is it? Have you contacted Yuya? You must be joking. I thought so. I have his address. Should I tell him about you? We need not worry him. I have no intention of asking favors of him. I didn't mean... Anyway, let it be. Things are fine as they are. I guess he's still a little chilly about Yuya. Maybe it's still too early. Let us go, Terry. Okay. To Karen. Salutations, I trust you're well. A little bird told me that you've been taking care of Sakuya. He's a pain, but I know you'll be able to handle him just fine. I have something to tell him. Something very important. Something I've been meaning to tell him his entire life. Since you're... Well, I guess I'm still a little unsure myself. If he ever says he wants to see me, I'll think it over. When that time comes, let me know, okay? I'll keep in touch. Adieu. Sakazaki Yuya. The end. Okay, what ending was that? Was that the full one, or was that... Let's see. Come on, go past. Because of the rain, I feel like maybe it wasn't the full one. I got Song of the Foolish Bird. Okay. We still need Into the Night. So maybe the guide was just a little wrong? I guess... Normal ending. Okay. So I guess that was the full ending. Let's Google real quick to make sure. Okay, yes. Song of the Foolish. So we did get the full ending. The guide is just a little bit wrong. <laughs> okay, so let's go again. We're going to speed past most of it and just look at the ending for uh, Into the Night. Okay, so here we go. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. I want human threads. Okay. We'll do the same, same thing with the map. map. I don't like <clears throat> oh, wow. I guess we'll see this little part. I guess I'll just cut it like I did before. So that they just see the same vibe. I don't know. What's the more character you get this time? I don't know. We'll find out, right? <laughs> but it should be all exactly the same. They've got the same scenes. Um, and it'll have a different ending. Okay, we can see this. We're still going to choose to make a couple. That's not changing. I'm going to attend now. Each of these type of games will be so easy. Because it's literally easy. Okay, we're going to choose Vice President. <clears throat> okay, talk to Sakuya. We're going to attend now. Then we're going to choose anything we choose. It's mostly the same, just not have all the parts of it. So we'll see what's there. Okay, sports festival, we're going to go with each of yours. It's something that the cheerleaders are going to get together. I guess that kind of makes sense, huh? <clears throat> I mean, I guess when I was doing it in high school, uh, we were kind of like, you know, part of that whole part, uh, thing with the cheerleaders. Like, we would do stuff like, within the next spot. We can go past this. So that kind of makes sense. Enjoy, you have to lately. Okay, we're gonna decide with Sakuya, obviously. We're gonna go to the store. Oh, we're kind of looking past this. Um, also, you guys are not following. Um, enjoy. You should. Let's do a shout out. Enjoy Destiny 2. Okay. Okay, we'll do it. 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 We'll do
finals. I did do well. So take him out. You help too. <clears throat> Not a job. Oh, let's click it. Hello, here we go. Unnecessary. I still want to copy that. Festival team, if you want a snack, we'll get one after this break. The return to the worries of Second term. I found the ID. Yes, we're gonna invite Korea to the house. Oh, interesting. Okay, we'll side with Kazuki. I guess we'll be so much math about this scene. I think all this is 11 to 10. We'll look. Yeah, what is the scene we're here like? Yeah, that'd be you. Sorry. We're gonna go to the party. I didn't realize what song this is. Uh, okay. Ah, oh, okay. So I guess if I'm it, when I'm doing the normal one, that's when I can get this scene, and I'm gonna choose fulfillment in art. Okay. So I guess the rain happened because I chose music every time. Thanks, Rio. You okay? But we already know what Rio is gonna say. If I get a new little Sakuya scene, though. The Kazuki. Oh, Bob White Blessing. New Blessing. Wait, isn't that... Do get a new scene. Sakuya? Huh? Oh, it's you. What are you doing here? I hadn't thought you were that type. I'm here to observe. I may one day be ruling this country, so there's no harm in familiarizing myself with the customs of the masses. That aside, I had heard the rumors, but this place is a battlefield. Some lunatic almost killed me throwing coins earlier. Oh, right. You don't get out too often. Those are offerings. They- Yes, I'm aware. The custom was created by a secret policeman during the Edo period, I believe. I never knew. I understand that the coins thrown by the policeman also inspired the shuriken later used by the ninja all across the country. To begin the year by testing each other's reflexes in deadly monetary skirmishes. Japan is truly a brutal country. He gazes with the mixed admiration and fear of the donations falling into the shrine box. Correcting him would be a pain, so I think I'll leave it at that. I guess it's not that's not true. Yeah, never though. No, I was talking about. Okay. Uh, so that was a new scene. Very cool. I see how the guy's a little bit messed up. It's slightly different. Whatever you do is regular versus home. Okay. And we need uh for Sakuya. Racing blend. Okay. Now we can see this ending. Today's day preparation is complete. Time to be the special summary. Sakuya. I'm busy. I'm asking to waste too much time. It's only taking a minute. I have something for you. Here. What do you use? It's a pricey blend of beans. I know you like expensive things. That's not what I meant. Where are you getting beans? It's a golden times. Who is that? Oh, that'd be funny. Why? The holiday. We're going to spend some beans. Like what? Too much reserved. Cheese. I gave you those. Will you accept them, Sophia? Mmm. These beans seem much cheaper. Less risky to get, but as you ask, I won't refuse them. Really? Hey. What do you mean? Like? I'm asking what you meant by the boys they like. Um. Exactly what I said. No matter where I am, you're beautiful. Enjoy the sunshine, Sophia. Um. Anyway, here. I hope you continue to get along. Indeed. He glances at the beans and then me and then more listening to you. I'm glad you like them. You did like them, right? It's cold. It feels even colder than around New Year's. I'm starting to think I should build a wall or maybe dig myself a new bedroom. With this kind of weather, some birds are even collapsing in the street. Hey, wait! Isn't that one Sakuya? Sakuya, what's wrong? Don't ask for details. Just carry me to your miserable abode. I beg of you. Wandering around and collapsing in the streets at this time of night doesn't seem like a customary practice for an aristocrat. What's happened, Sakuya? Don't tell me your family has fallen from high society. What happened? I shall not say. Huh? What were you doing wandering around in the wilderness, then? I was not wandering. I was on my way here. Be honored. Oh, so this isn't a coincidence after all. Did you want something from me, then? No, don't flatter yourself. Huh? Um, should we call your family or something? No. Huh? He looks really angry. Listen, don't. You dare. Don't you dare call my house. Sakuya, did you run away from home? That sounds bad. No, I simply left of my own volition. Um, isn't that the same thing? Yeah. What happened, Sakuya? Harry, you remember when we talked in the music room at school last fall? Yes. What about it? You remember what I asked you then? He asked me about what I love, and I love udon. You asked me what I loved. That's right. And you give a simple, honest answer right away. And that's... that? That made me jealous. Did I miss here? That's the last thing I'd expect from him, of all people. I don't understand, Sakuya. Why? I... 
I'm one of the few, the pure bloodline. I am ranked higher than any of my siblings. I have been slated to become the next family head since birth. There's no reason I shouldn't be. But you don't want to take your father's place. How did you know that? It's obvious. It's written all over your face. I love music, but my father does not approve. When I was young, I owned a number of instruments, but he had them all thrown away. Art is not our realm. Joy of creation is the domain of peasants. Our role is to be patrons and promoters of artists we admire, not to be artists ourselves. A noble who sows his own wheat is a fool. That's not true. I think anyone can play music should be encouraged, no matter who their parents are. That is because you think with a peasant's values. My world is different from yours. I am not talking about what peasants think. I'm talking about what I think. What about you, Sakuya? What do you think? What do I think? Speak in riddles. I carry the name of Labelle. To play at applying my own standards and ideals to the world would be a disgrace. But didn't you just say you left the mansion of your own accord? Isn't that applying your own idea to the world? Hmm. You've contradicted yourself. What do you want to do in life, Sakuya? I must succeed my father as the next family head. No, geez, that's not what I meant. What if you could forget about the LaBelle family and do anything in the world? What would you do then? Forget about the LaBelle family? What mockery is this? We're speaking hypothetically, dummy. If I could do anything in the world, I would continue studying music. I would like to hear how far I could go as a musician. He sounds uncharacteristically modest. I was half expecting to give some rambling speech about how he would unite the world and become king or something. You love music, don't you? If I could hear you play the piano again, I would be very happy, Sakia. I think you've answered your own question. Answered my own question. Don't be ridiculous. This is a mere fantasy. It has no connection to reality. But you told your father that you want to continue studying music. Don't be ridiculous. How could I lower myself so? So you haven't even asked him about it. You wouldn't be lowering yourself, Sakuya. You ashamed to love music. You should ask him. It's worth a try, right? Perhaps you're right. I suppose I never would have thought of that if I hadn't talked to you. You were confused about what you wanted, Sakuya. I just gave you a little push. Very. Yes? I'm going to speak with him when I return. If he refuses, would you carry my fallen body to safety one more time? Are you planning to run away for real next time? If it comes to that. I will follow you anywhere you need to go, Sakuya. You'll always have a safe place here, okay? I shall return to you. Thank you, Terry. Okay, so that was all the same. And so he set out across the wilderness once more. I don't know if his father will accept him or if he really will run away, but I know he will come back to me, and I pray that our future will be a happy one. Okay, so we don't, we just don't get the little ending, so it is just like the other. Very cute. Very, very cute. Geo Nation. Okay, Into the Night, ending number two. All right. Okay. All right, you guys. So, so for those watching on the YouTube VOD, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Thanks so much for watching. And of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.